what up all my clients i have right here the full containments of my entire kitchen right here is a personal setup that i'm gonna make for my salmon i mean thus don't freak out this was like 25 dollars more or less this is 3.8 pounds i'm gonna split this up make a nice little sauce with all this season this bad boy and then if i could break this up to between like two to three nights more or less depending on how many people i make i got two packages of chicken one big one i can make that with all these other meals that i got right here i'm gonna move that to the side as long as eggs and i got more eggs in the fridge with an avocado i got more avocados banana love bananas and of course i got some you know cheerios with some white milk you know in case i do want to have some cereal in the morning more or less it, every i don't have it every day but i got ground turkeys right here pretty cheap and then what it's a seal is this cauliflower right here. You got 20 calories, and then you're gonna have two grams per calorie. That is a great calorie for the per, uh, protein per calorie uh, per basis ratio. Sausage, if I wanna mix up the meat, you know, so I could chop this up, and then I got three bags of potatoes. These are cheap. I could chop this up, throw that in the oven, or put that in the skillet, and then chop that up too, and then I got turkey smoked sausage with like baked potatoes or i could switch it up if i ever get steak and i could put a baked potato and it's delicious sweet potato fries you're looking at 150 calories per serving and then you got two grams of protein that's a lot of protein for a carb course. obviously i got parmesan cheese goat cheese for my salads carrots to put in the oven roasted uh, tomatoes for salads to zucchini squash uh soup on the you know low cal calorie day and i'm not trying to move around as much uh 370 for the entire thing couscous high in protein uh, i also recommend the quinoa of course these pizzas are gonna be 930 to like 960 uh or 980 more or less for the entire thing it's gonna be pretty solid 15 grams 46 grams for the entire thing not solid 15 grams 46 grams for the entire thing not bad and of course right here i do have these pastas I got linguine with clam, more linguine, and then I got fettuccine alfredo, and then I'll make that on my days where I'll use it as fuel the next day as like explosive workouts, full body workouts, heavy lifting workouts. I got the gnocchi right here that's going to go great with this gnocchi pasta. Excellent choice. And then if I'm snacking, I go with the mixed nuts that's going to have all types of proteins. It's going to have all the amino acids you need to because there's going to be like at least eight essential and you're gonna need the rest you can get this right here i have extras in my last package of the mountain trail mix but i also have switched it up i have cashews too i have peanut butter i also got bread over there if i ever want to make pb and j's rice of course but going back to over this slowly i got a bunch of potatoes sweet potato fries cauliflower and mix up my sides in case i got broccoli rice so i can make uh stir fry mixes i can season these with thyme and black pepper and make oven roasted carrot sticks in the oven or i could chop it up and make salads with what i got i also have like romaine lettuce and everything in the fridge so like my fridge isn't completely emptied out but this is like a good picture though of what is a good idea like right here i got and i got muffin mix because i do like muffins you know you don't have to like torture yourself i got bone broth and then i got chicken broth too you know for like some recipes and whatnot but like you know in here i got like some big heavy duty tomato sauce if i want to soak that in meatballs um and more or less i just got like a bunch of things that can get me through a day an onion but yeah Plan ahead, get a lot of meats, and then you're forced to not go out and spend because you already spent that money. You already committed to all this food. And then with all this meats and stuff, I just freeze it so I can take my time whenever I need to cook it instead of letting it go to waste. So.